And so ahead of the 2023 presidential election, politicians are not leaving any stone unturned uh, towards the emergence of a southerner to take over from uh, incumbent President Muhammadu Buhari. They share their thoughts on how that can be best achieved across party divides. Our correspondent, Lushego Lukoga, tells us more. Very soon, the political terrain will be heated with a lot of activities once the nation's electoral commission gives the go-ahead. The polity is also gathering momentum across party divides on diverse internal, external and national issues, which is not limited to Congress's convention and particularly who becomes Nigeria's next president. The way it goes, power belongs to God. But it's also not sad a la carte. It is for people who aspire to get it. And there is something wrong in people aspiring. But there is everything wrong in everybody now struggling in such a way that at the end of the day, nothing is achieved. A former governor of Ogun State, Benga Daniel, and other political stakeholders share the opinion that Southwest leaders and top monarchs need to consult, consider, and streamline the number of politicians vying for the presidential seat in the region. There are so many of our people who are qualified, who are strong, who are willing, who are able. But if we really want to retain that opportunity, it's incumbent on all our elders and leaders to come together and streamline. If they come together and say, okay, consider one or two people, the chances that Nigerians may respond, may respect that wish. For the development of the country, it's also good that you know we rotate between the north and the south. And the north having been there for eight years, I think it is only right for it to come to the south. Oh, and of course, when it gets to the south, every part of the south, the three, you know, uh, section of the south are entitled. To. And now that they have served their own eight years, I think it is fair to assume and also to make a case for presidency to come to the Southwest. Deputy Minority Leader at the House of Representatives, Shegun Adekoya, maintains that Southwest has capable hands to solve the current economic challenges. In administration, in fixing government, Yoruba are super. I know we have security challenge, but I'm persuaded that if you fix this economic challenge, the security challenge will automatically fix itself. People are hungry. People are dying on the roads. If they are busy, you, they, 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 I mean, you will not find them. Some are, however, of the opinion that strict adherence to national interests is what many consider should be paramount as the race to replace President Muhammadu Buhari begins. From Ogun State, Olushegun, Olukoga, Silverbed News 24, Abel Kuta.